Attempting the mythical ninja trick of walking on water, Adam went nowhere but under. But as the silent observer of his numerous dunkings, Jamie's had time to think, and he's come up with a mysterious solution. There is something that I've come up with that you can walk on it. It does have a lot of water in it. I'd like to see how that works. His covert concoction is 200 gallons of water and 1,000 pounds of powdery cornstarch. Trusted myth turn Jess is in charge of getting the consistency just right. Give me up some pancakes! Some blue food coloring completes the recipe. Okay, we're good. Are we ready to pour? Yeah, here you are. The mixture is tipped into a large plastic container that represents a deep samurai moat. Adam is perplexed. What is this stuff? It's water. <laughs> it's got something else in it, but it's water. It's and a Heinemann version of water. Yeah, and you're going to walk on it. No way. Way. There's nothing Adam would rather do than play in a giant tub of goo. Look at this. <laughs> Finally, the container is filled to the brim, and our ninja novice soaks up some advice from Sensei Heinemann. I think he ought to get one good stride across it. As far as hanging out there and walking around or even hopping, I have my doubts. All right, well, I want to go. Adam scales the imaginary wall and is ready to cross the water obstacle. <laughs> think like those movies where they're walking up bamboo and stuff, you know. <laughs> All right, here we go. <laughs> 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 that is so cool! Hey, it worked. It sure did. Adam ran across the surface. The reason is, the cornstarch and water combo is a non-Newtonian fluid, and these kinds of fluids change their viscosity. It looks like a liquid, it pours like a liquid, but when you want to run across it, you're fine because the impact of your feet is enough to change that balance. All of a sudden, you've got a solid that you're dealing with only for a second, but it's long enough for you to move across the top of it without sinking into it. I'm just going to go back and forth a couple of times because it's really fun. Adam shatters the perception that shadow warriors don't know how to have a good time. <laughs> Big Ninja is a hard job! <laughs> it wants to let you go down, doesn't it? All right, so this is just to show there's no trickery involved. This is actually a liquid. I'm going to step into it. I'm going to sink. Then I'm going to change my clothes. Oh, oh that's funky. <laughs> oh, dude, that feels so wrong. So it's a far-fetched idea for feudal Japanese times. But corn was introduced to Japan around the 16th century, right around the time ninjas existed. And it sure was fun. Oh, come on in. The water's great. Of course, this is a little on the silly side. I mean, yes, it's a liquid, but uh, are you really going to have large quantities of cornstarch mixed up and sitting around someplace, I suppose, maybe next to a cornstarch factory in Asia somewhere and you happen to be a ninja and you happen to be trying to sneak around. It's a bit of a stretch. All right, so this is the end of the line for walking on water. What do you think? It's busted. Totally busted. Let's go home. All right.